AIDS Love Line. I'm Adam Carolla. That's uh, Dr. Drew over there. And David Allen Greer is here. Who's uh, Preaching, baby. Thank you so much. I really, Guys in the booth, please sit down. I really yeah, think yeah. he's got to have some chew in him. Oh, he's, he's obsessed with the medications. He's oh, neurotic. Back pain. He's and back a, pain. Is there oh, any... Is oi, there, oi, Dr. it hurts. Drew, Dr. Drew, I tried so hard to get some painkillers from this Mexican doctor. I slammed my head in the door. He, I, doctor! <laughs> but you know what? If you mix that with some NyQuil... Ooh, baby. You get that too. And some Red Bull. Oh, that's nice on the rocks. David. Let's take some calls. Let's take some calls. David David was talking during the break about his dad uh, having an embarrassing revelation <laughs> to him. But it reminded me, I uh, I hung out with my grandmother tonight. Oh. And, uh, Has she been nice, listening? Nice segue. I owe you that one. My grandmother likes to uh, also give sexually revealing things oh. to me that make me feel uncomfortable. You she think you feel 90. bad? She must be 90. It's her, it's her birthday. I think she's 88. She's uh, way up there. And she's, uh, she's asked me many things over the years. Uh, for yeah. instance, uh, do you know what a rim job is? <laughs> Are you, is, is legitimately, she, is she, is she's not senile. No, no she's all no. there. Oh, she was God a sex her. therapist. God Someone brought her. up rim job in one of her groups, and she didn't know what it was. Oh, so she, she asked she me what a rim job was. Embarrassed. There was another. But tell them what you said off the air. You said, "Bend over, Grandma. I'll show you." <laughs> <laughs> That's my time. Enjoy your headliner. <laughs> Did you hear that, Doctor Drew? I said, "Bend over, Grandma. I'll show you." <laughs> oh, so, that's great. So to tonight, be alive. tonight she's getting out of my car, oh, and you know what I love? It, 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 it's something that all old people do, which is um, nothing's quite right. Mm. Everything's a bad design or not working mm. right. You know, every time she climbs into my car, she spends ten minutes trying to get the seatbelt buckled, right. and then I reach over and snap it in place, and she gives that. Well, this thing is not designed yeah. right. No, it's not. It's not designed for someone as Parkinson's. It's, right. I have no trouble with it, right. in, in other you're words. Young, but she, she's climbing out of the car, and the car has bucket seats, and she's riding up on the edge. Oh, boy. You know, she's straddling yeah. the edge, trying to get on and get onto the walker, and I'm helping her out and everything. And she said, uh, this, the, the side of this seat has gone up my crotch, she says. Oh, and I go, boy. okay. She takes a beat, and she goes, nothing's been up there for a while. <laughs> <laughs> Am I asked you not. <laughs> uh, please, I, I beg of you. <laughs> 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 One time she was talking about lubricant, about vaginal lubricant. Please, can I be dismissed? How old was she at the time? Uh, she was 85. <laughs> and what did she say? Well, my grandfather just passed away about three years ago, yeah. and she was mourning pretty good, and she was uh, saying, everything around here reminds me of him. I oh. found his shoes. I see his picture. I see the vaginal lube. I'm sorry. I guess, can I get some rags? I, I, I'll i clean up. I really, right, yeah. Oh, yeah, let's take a call. I'm going to take some calls. I'm just, quite, I'm quite a bit of banana. Oh, you know, because the hair goes green. <laughs> It goes gray down there. No, you lose it. Oh, you lose the hair down there. You become like an old uh, woman child. Uh, I kind of like that. <laughs> I think I'm coming back. I think I'm coming. You know what I think would heal all of society? Uh, Plain talk about sex from in the house. It's a natural thing. Yeah, that's right. Well, how about President Bush's recent initiative to eliminate all that talk? Well, $130 billion dollars we spent on apps. Where's Lee Harvey Oswald when we really need him, really? <laughs> Please. Andy? Does he have any relatives? I mean, right? You know, I'm doing the O'Reilly Report next week to have a little oh, discussion boy. about this thing. Andy? Yeah? You're 16? Yeah? What's up? I was wondering if I could get my girlfriend pregnant from anal sex. Mm, right. Yes. Cut him off. How? Cut him off. Well, she was kind of freaking out about it. Like, I was trying to get her to do it, you know? And then she's like, oh, make sure you wear a condom because I don't want to get pregnant. Have you ever heard of a turd baby? <laughs> no. How would, you, how would that work? How would a semen get to well, a uterus? Like, if, like I pulled out, you know, and it, leaked it just somewhere. got on there. All right, we'll be oh, careful. Huh? Well, wait a minute. I think what he's referring to is, it's what it's known as running sperm. Now, there, you've heard of walking catfish, the African walking catfish. Um, no, but her Australia. the size of a oh. mason jar. Oh, oh Andy. 
No, you, you didn't sell it well. Yeah, we were already going well. But David had a point anyway, which is the African running catfish. Australian. Walking, Australian. walking Australian. catfish. Australian. Yeah. Well, there are sperm. You know, we as men produce millions and millions of sperm. Yeah. There are certain sperm. This is a medical fact, Dr. Drew. You know this. They're fighting sperm. Absolutely. Yes, they're fighting sperm. sperm that they actually will walk from the uh, back door to the front door. Really? Absolutely. They can wiggle and walk right across that little stretch, that little between skin, and jump in there. Wow. And just, yeah, so watch it. All right. All right. Watch it, you know, all you kids. You know what I would like? I, and, Drew, I think you would enjoy this, too. Let's take some calls. Let's From take some calls. At least a medical standpoint. Lisa, you're 19. What, What's what your I problem? Hear this? I would enjoy watching a reel of what goes on in David Allen Greer's head when he masturbates. It's, it's I, slowed down. I picture it like, down, a, like no. a Fellini film. Yeah, it'd have to be slowed way it's down. Mother chasing yeah, yeah. with a knife. Oh, yeah. Well, anything can, kill it. anything can kill trains it. Trains going into trouble. Stocking human cannon going off. Couple fly girls circa 1991. I like the freaks. I like the young honey bunnies. Why is it rubbers, like when you see condoms in porno flicks, it's a total turnoff? For me, it is. Yeah, yeah, me too. Uh, let, all right, let, well, let's address that for one second. <laughs> why? Why is that? And I, I agree. And you know what? I, you know what I? I think it is it's an intrusion. And this is going to be. This is going to be. Um, this is going to be sad, David. But I hope you're man enough to cop this one. Go. Go. I think a lot of guys watch porn because it's uh, it's dirty and it's nasty, right. and it's not just all about sexuality. It's about uh, they got this aggression. chick to do porn. Aggression. There's a little aggression in there. And and uh, it's it's a little degrading. It's too civilized to put a condom on. And when on. you put the condom on, it becomes a little civil yeah. and a little less degrading, and it becomes a little more clinical, and it's not so nasty anymore. Right, here's another thing that turns me off. You know, like when you're watching porno, and you see the porno chick, she looks at the camera like, are, are we, okay, keep going, okay. <laughs> that, that kills me. I like you know that. I like that. I, I hate that when they're like, oh, 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 you know, like she's waiting for the coffee break. No. No. You know, my, direct those pornos. my favorite part of the porn is the credits when the uh, key grip is named Dick Nibbler. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to say, like, like <laughs> don't bother with a credit if you're going with <laughs> Why go with a credit? <laughs> you, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I know, I know, I know. Or well, maybe, maybe you just well, stick with... Uh, a lot of legitimate writers uh, write for porn. One of the guys who uh, created my show what? wrote for porn. Yeah, wrote for porn. He two, shall remain two boy, nameless. one girl, a. He, what, that's he the, shall, that's he the shall script? remain nameless because he doesn't want people to know. But, Andy but there's Gordon, no script. Andy what Gordon, is the script? Andy Gordon. Andy, Andy Gordon. Gordon. Andy what Gordon is the script? Wrote for porn. Andy Gordon wrote for porn. <laughs> what is? But script? I'm not gonna. What know. is the script? Seven pages. The pizza man rings the doorbell. Go. 